Today we're going to be taking a look at these Rock Candy Barbies. And I want to say thank you so much to Mattel for sending these to me. So I have four of them here to review. So let's go ahead and take a look at the packaging. So this is what the back of all the packages look like. It shows the original Barbie and it also has a little blurb. And it also shows you all the different Barbies in this line to collect. So there's eight total. So here is both sides of the packaging. They're all the same in that aspect. Also the bottom and the tops are all the same except for the date. So the date of the Barbie. Like this one says 1980. This one says 1977. 1986. And we have 1971. So I'm gonna go ahead and take all of these beautiful figures out of their packaging and we're gonna take a closer look at them. So here they all are out of the packaging. They are super gorgeous and they're really well made because they're manufactured by Funko and their quality is just been so good lately. But anyways, they also come with these stands. They do stand on their own just fine, but they also come with these clear stands. I almost did not see them in the packaging, but I discovered them and I was like, oh hey, they come with stands, awesome. So let's take a look at them one at a time. So we're actually going to start with the 1986 Barbie and work our way backwards. Um, I'm gonna start with this one because I cannot get her on her stand. It looks like her stand is not the right size for her because the stand does not fit her feet because if I put in this peg it cannot reach the other foot or vice versa and they do not even fit in her feet like I tried to kind of squeeze her feet in a little bit and her feet these um, holes right here just do not fit I don't know if she accidentally came with the wrong stand or if the holes just weren't made big enough. I'm not quite sure, but I cannot get her on the stand. I got the other ones on just fine. They're really easy to put on, but I cannot get this to work for me. I'm not quite sure what's going on. Um, maybe it's user error, but I can't even get the other foot to reach. So not quite sure what's going on there, but she does stand fine on her own. Um, but this is what she looks like. I really love the big hair and it's very, you know, 1986 as it says. And I love the striped stockings and her boots. And I love that she has a microphone. She's very, very pretty and well detailed and just, oh my gosh, these are so cute. I love them. And I love the bow in her hair and the makeup and everything. She's just very detailed and very, very beautiful. So let's move on to 1980. So here we have the Barbie from 1980 and I just love her red dress and her red shoes and the like cold shoulder cutouts in her dress and the bold gold necklace. And I love the hair and the makeup and the earrings. She's just, I love how these are so just, they're beautiful. They're like perfect for the era. They look just like the Barbies they're supposed to represent. And so this is the one from 1980 and she is just gorgeous. I got her on the stand just fine. She popped right on there and everything. So that is what she looks like. Next, we are going back to 1977 to take a look at this Barbie. I love her blue eyeshadow and I love this um, feather boa, I guess it is. Her pink dress, her pink shoes and her glam earrings and her long curly blonde hair. Well, she's got a little bit of curl. She looks so good and the hands on the hip, just a little bit of sass. So that's what she looks like. She was also very easy to get on her stand as well, but these do stand pretty well on their own and they are well made and I just love the detail on this one as well. So let's take a look at 1971 next. So here we have the Barbie from 1971 and I love her groovy outfit. And she's got a belt around her waist that leads all the way back. And then she also has her long blonde hair and she's got her headband on and her nice makeup and everything. I love her little bangles around her wrists and her shoes as well. She was also very easy to get on the stand and I just, she's gorgeous. I love the detailing and everything. So there is the last figure. 
So those were the Rock Candy Funko Barbie figures. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite. I think my favorite has to be the 1986 Barbie, despite the stand issues, um, because I love the bright colors. I love the big bow in her hair. I love the big hair and the, everything. It's just the whole getup is fantastic. I love it. But anyways, guys, make sure to like this video, leave a comment down below, and please make sure to subscribe to see more videos just like this one. And I will see you all next time for another review. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!